Over the course of her 50-year career, Viola Fry produced an impressive body of artwork, including sculpture, paintings, and drawings, but she is best known for her brilliantly colored, monumental ceramic figures. Fry belonged to a generation of California artists who pushed the boundaries of clay from a medium associated with craft to one associated with sculptural artwork. Her multifaceted approach and training as a painter and sculptor taught her to experiment using contemporary materials, art historical and pop cultural references, and a personal iconography which she gathered from her surroundings. These deep sources of imagery allowed Fry to reflect on culture, power, gender dynamics, and in one particular series, the broad topic of Western civilization. The artworks in this exhibition come from that series. When asked about her early artistic inspiration, Viola Fry answered, I had to make my own culture. The family's grape farm in California was far from art museums and other cultural institutions, so she found inspiration in her surroundings, which would have a lasting impact on her art. During her graduate studies at Tulane University, she explored color and its effect on the senses. Bright, expressive colors became one of her artistic signatures. She was also introduced to the history of art and incorporated elements like ancient vessels and Venus figures into her visual vocabulary. This massive artwork is called The Decline and Fall of Western Civilization. Fry always worked in large scale, but this is the biggest sculpture she ever created. She started working with monumental figures in 1976 when she acquired her own kiln and could work in her backyard. The figures, which started off life-size, grew until two buckled under their own weight. After that, she developed the technique that you see here. She hand-built individual sections that weigh between 40 to 75 pounds each. This sculpture is made of 155 individual pieces that are bolted together from the inside. Since sculptures like this are essentially three-dimensional puzzles, they take months to create and require careful planning. Because of this, Fry was unable to be spontaneous with her form, but she could express herself with her color. She would mix glazes, add gestured lines, and incorporate texture to make the sculptures vibrant and colorful. Monumental, the art of Viola Fry, is on view until October 25th.